All right, folks. A couple weeks ago, I won a giveaway for NYC Reloaders Hunter Subscriber Giveaway. It's been a couple weeks. I haven't opened it yet. Did not open. Wife did not open. But I wanted to do it on camera so everybody could see what he gave me. I, I would encourage people to go visit NYC Reloader. He's got 102 subscribers now. He's only got seven or eight videos, but I think he could probably put out some good info, and give us some good videos in the future. So he sent me a world's cheapest trimmer. So I am going to open it up. Hopefully with my... 300 subscriber giveaway from Uncle Jim. Let's see if it does its job. The wife has been using it. She says it works for her. Ooh, it's in. Ooh. All right. World's cheapest trimmer. Black Creek, Wisconsin. I've I've been through Black Creek, Wisconsin. It's not very big. The uh, this bag's gonna come in handy for holding it. Okay, this is plastic, so hopefully it won't mar the brass at all. But I heard this leaves a line on the brass, but that's not really a big deal for me. Okay, so I have my book open. My book says case trim length 1.750. This one piece of brass is at 1.761. I have my Lee case trimmer engaged ready. And if I put it in here, It will cut if it needs to. So we're going to try this. You should be able to chuck this up in a drill. And just beep, beep. But everybody's asleep. I don't wake anybody up. So I'm going to do it by hand. It's cutting it. Okay. It's a nice clean cut. And that puts it from 1762 to 1755. Let's see if I have the right Allen wrench here. Yes, I do. So I should be able to adjust that a little bit. And again, now you see a little little mark along the edge, but one seven four eight. So yeah, I adjusted a little too far, but two thousands isn't a big deal. One seven four eight. I don't know if that'll focus or not. But yeah, get that in a drill. I've actually got a drill press right behind the camera. I could probably squeeze it in there. And then just stick the brass up inside of it. There's a little line, not bad. It's not like it's a gouge or anything. It's leave a little burr, but let's try it in this. Oh, that's done its job. Let's see if this will cut it. Nope. It's 
So yeah, I think that'll work good for zipping through brass. One, two, I got pails full of brass. So that's going to come in handy. Thank you, NYC Reloader. This is going to get used a lot. Probably a lot more than this, but this will always be a good fail safe or take up to the camp and have it at the camp. I'm going to go that route. But I would also like to encourage everybody to go over to Slack, sign on to Slack, get yourself set up on Slack. Everybody's doing it. It's the coolest thing ever. And then get over there, get your account, and then sign up and go to the reloadersnetwork.com it's a growing community of like-minded people who reload cast shoot outdoor activities little politics but nothing bad but i would encourage you to go there i'll put a link in the description to go to the slack or the reloaders network in the bottom of this so yeah i would i would definitely recommend it as for me, today, I wanted to do the unboxing for a 100 subscriber giveaway and announce my own giveaway. So, I'm going to give this, I'm at 102 subscribers, thanks to the Reloaders Network and Slack. I mentioned I had 99, next thing I know I had 102, so that was cool. I would say I'm going to give this till, what's the day? Today's the 25th. I'm going to go till midnight on the 4th of May. I'm going to give it a week and a half, almost. Maybe the 5th. We'll go noon on the 5th. And then... I was thinking, you know, I felt bad letting NYC Reloader buy this for me, but he insisted. So I think I'm going to pay it forward. Not this, this is mine. I'm going to pay it forward and I'm going to do something nice. I'm thinking $50 gift card. I want to give one winner... A $50 gift card for Midway USA, Natchez, Acme Bullets, whoever does gift cards, I'll go online, I'll buy it, and then maybe just email it to whoever wins. I volunteered overtime at work so I could pay for a giveaway. So I want to have want to make sure whoever joins the giveaway go in the description box say I'm in and I would prefer well let's make it mandatory I want to I want to be able to see you in my subscriptions I want to be able to go into who subscribed to me and see if you say I'm in and I see you in my subscriptions then I know you're a subscriber I don't want to give it away to Joe Blow, who is not a subscriber. So I want to encourage the people who come back to me. So we're going to go to the 5th, noon on the 5th. I'm going to end the drawing. And by that time, hopefully, I'll figure out a way to do the drawing. So game on. Yeah, game on.